seconds of the massive eruption of Kilauea Volcano of Hawaii was recently caught on camera. A video released by the U.S. Geological Survey shows an area inside the volcano where rapidly rising hot air is grabbing fresh lava and throwing it into the air before traveling down the side of the mountain and sucking up soil and rock. Stunning video footage from the volcano's 12th episode shows lava shooting out of the volcano and spiraling into the air, creating what is being described as a lava tornado. The rare event occurred around 4 a.m. and lasted for about five minutes. The heat from the lava mixed with cooler air on the mountain to create a tornado-like or funnel cloud-like action. The US Geological Survey describes a lava tornado as a swirling mass of air inside a caldera, a large depression formed by the collapse of a volcano's center after an eruption. The video of the lava tornado was taken during Kilauea, ongoing 12th episode of the summit eruption, which began around 6.22 p.m. local time and ended the next morning at about 7.06 a.m. local time, according to the Hawaii Volcano Observatory. The observatory said the eruption plume reached a peak height of about 600 feet, visited the national park to watch the volcano activity around the clock, and witnessed seven of the 12 ongoing summit eruption episodes. The USGS said each eruption episode lasted about 13 hours and had been separated by lulls of activity of about a day to 12 days between episodes. The Hawaiian volcano's lava flow peaked during the latest episode, which has been intermittent and has continued for months. Webcam footage showed red hot lava gushing out and smoke billowing. The eruption began in a crater at the summit of Kilauea in Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. The duration of each eruption episode has varied from a few hours to several days. No residential areas are threatened by the eruption. People flocked to locations within the park to watch the fiery spectacle. Halemaumau erupted for the twelfth time as sporadic lava flows began alternating between its southern and northern cones, according to the U.S. Geological Survey's Hawaiian Volcano Observatory. This is the twelfth round of lava flows. Each lava flow lasts about 14 hours before lulls between events that last anywhere from 1 to 12 days. Continuous jets of water from the southern vent continued overnight to heights of 200 to 400 feet before subsiding Wednesday morning. Visitors to the park were treated to spectacular views from a safe distance. However, the National Park Service warns that volcanic activity can produce dangerous gases, such as sulfur dioxide. These particles can be especially dangerous for those with heart or respiratory problems. Park officials have established designated viewing areas to ensure public safety while allowing for optimal viewing 
of the lava show. Despite the dramatic eruption, no residential areas are currently at risk. Authorities have warned of potential environmental and health hazards. The Hawaiian Volcano Observatory noted high levels of volcanic gases, primarily water vapor, carbon dioxide, and sulfur dioxide. These gases can cause the formation of volcanic ash that poses a respiratory risk to people downstream from the eruption site.